Around half of all sight impaired Australians have an age related disease known as macular degeneration. The disease causes cells in the retina, the light sensing part of the rear of the eye, to stop converting absorbed light into electrochemical signals. As the signal is not received by the brain, a complete image is not formed and blindness is the result. A consortium of Australian researchers is being formed to develop a microchip that is implanted in the retina and restores functional vision to people affected by this disease. The partners will include NICTA, the Bionic Ear Institute, the University of Melbourne Centre for Eye Research Australia and the University of New South Wales. The challenge is to develop a chip with a large number of electrodes because more electrodes result in a higher pixel count and clearer vision for the patient. If successful, NICTA's bionic eye technology will incorporate several thousand stimulators. The result will be to restore the user's sight to a level where they'll no longer be legally blind. The prototype will most likely look like this. A camera attached to a pair of spectacles. The tiny camera will transmit images via high frequency radio waves to the microchip implanted in the retina. This data is converted into electrical impulses which, through the aid of electrodes, stimulate cells that connect to the optic nerve. The electrical impulses are then interpreted by the brain as an image. It's estimated that this project will take around five to seven years to complete. The benefits of this technology are obvious. Combining advanced engineering with medical know-how to restore sight, enabling people to live more independent and mobile lives.